Okay, it was asked that I explain the filtration. So, in the salt water tank, the rocks are your filtration. They harbor the bacteria that convert the ammonia in the nitrite cycle and uh, keep the water clean. The drains, I've got these filter floss like stuff. It's just kind of like a plastic netting to keep the fish from going into the drain because the drains are big enough that even my tang could probably get sucked into there. So that keeps the fish out. And back here, got two pumps. One pump pumps fresh water to recover any evaporation. The other one pumps salt water when I do a water change. And back here, beneath the stairs, this is a skimmer. It's a protein skimmer. It skims the uh, ick out of the water. Right now it's breaking in. It's brand new, so it's not really functional yet. So I've got it wide open, and I've got the plug open to allow it to drain. When it's broken in, I'll replug that and I'll turn it down a little bit so that it will collect a greenish brown sludge in that cup. And that's the fish poop and any other debris floating in the water will get accumulated in there. But as you can see, the drains drain down in. Uh, my heaters are down in there. I've got a mangrove growing that helps absorb some of the nitrates and I've got two pumps that return the water back to the tank. Now those pumps with my apex controller they pump anywhere from 320 to almost 1600 gallons per hour each and they alternate every 15 seconds all in all this tank empties and refills about 14 times an hour